Hey guys, welcome back to Pod Therapy. If this is your first time stopping by, my name is Keela. Hey, if not, thank you for the support. In today's video, I will be doing a review on this beautiful short unit that I have on. I am starting a short wig series, so you guys don't want to miss it. So I would suggest that you go ahead and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and turn on your post notification bells so you don't miss anything. I post videos every Sunday and Thursday and you don't want to miss them. Now, let's get into this video. Okay, y'all, so I am back with another wig review. I'm starting a new series. This series will be short wigs, so anywhere from really, really short to, you know, maybe eight inch bob-ish bob -ish length. Um, but I have about 10, 15 wigs that I'm gonna review for you guys and they are all short and this is totally out my comfort zone i have been trying to get out my comfort zone more and more i hope you guys enjoy my blonde wig series that um just finished a couple months ago i decided to try another series so here we are one of um my facebook friends sent me over some stuff and she was like i think you should try this i think this will look good on you so i was like hey why not make a whole series about it so that is what brought me to the short wig series if you guys have some wigs or some videos or some series some suggestions whatever that you guys think that i would be good at or y'all would like for me to review please comment down below and let me know so the first wig we're going to be reviewing um is going to be from bobby boss now y'all know that this um particular company is not new to this channel i have tried bobby boss wigs i have a few of them in fact i want to do okay so as i was saying as you guys know bobby boss is not new to this channel i reviewed a few of their wigs this is one of my top five favorite synthetic wig companies in fact i want to do like some videos showing my favorite wigs from each company so that may be something i do later on in the year but that's something that um, I have worked in the works as well. But so the wig I'm reviewing today is going to be Bobby Boss and the style M1051 Tisha, Tisha, I guess you say, in the color 2. This is what the car looks like again. And they have a whole little collection with these particular wigs. So this is what they look like on the back, the collection. And they have a range of different colors that you can um, try them in. Also, they are featured colors. So you have a copper and you have, and on the side it says like which wig is available and which color also. So that's really nice. Um, but yeah, they have Scarlet, Tisha, which is what we're reviewing. Y'all probably can't see this. Um, Ronice and Stephanie. And this is the one that I'm reviewing. And I just got it in the solid color too. So I'm not going to um, lie to y'all. I'm really nervous about this. Because I don't really wear short hair. Because my face is so... Like I don't feel like short hair fits my face. So I'm like extremely nervous about trying this out. But... 2023 is all about getting out of our comfort zones and just you know doing it so here we are this is what we're gonna do okay so it does not come with any combs that i see it is breathable material just in case you guys want to see there's no lace i don't see any combs but it does have adjustable straps in the back if you need to adjust it i didn't do any clips because i mean I don't think you guys need to see this on a wig, I mean, on a mannequin head. So I didn't do any clips. But if y'all would like for me to do clips on the short wigs, just comment down below and let me know. All right, so let's throw this baby on. Okay, so, so far, so good. It's giving me like a little um, mohawk vibe, so to speak. Um... Okay, y'all, let me go throw some accessories on, and I'll be right back. Okay, y'all, so I feel like this wig is definitely giving me 
rich auntie vibes it's rich auntie season like y'all i don't know like i like it in the i didn't wear it like the stock card i actually kind of made it into a mohawk because i have a small head so i feel like this just shapes my face better um it definitely makes me look older I don't know if you guys feel that way, but I feel that way. I feel like it definitely makes me look older. I feel like it's really cute pair with the gold accessories. But, um, I feel like this is a good wig. Um, Bobby Boss hadn't really let me down too many times with some of the wigs that I reviewed for them. Now, I do have one that I reviewed that was a curly wig that I didn't really, um, enjoy. I didn't really like it. I think it was in my blonde wig series, but... I feel like this wig is giving, you know, like I said, rich auntie vibes. Let's go to the family reunion. A family reunion. That's how I feel with this wig on. Like, I don't know, y'all. What y'all think? Y'all comment down below and tell me what y'all think. This is what the back looks like. It's really nice cut. Like, I feel like this gives like a luxur luxurious haircut without you actually having a haircut like so if you ladies if you are thinking about cutting your hair and you want to know what the haircut will look like on you i suggest picking up one of these short wigs and trying them out and then if you like the way it look on you then you know how to go ahead and cut your hair in this particular style but i feel like if you just want something temporary you just want to look different get you a short wig because this is it y'all i really like this i think this is a good opening first wig especially for me because i am not used to wearing short wigs if you've been following my channel you know i usually wear long hair like the shortest i go is probably 10 inches and that's the bob so doing something like this like really really short a pixie cut is you know not really my thing, but I do like it. Um, as far as the shine, I feel like it didn't come with any luster on it. It's not shiny. I didn't have to add any dry shampoo. The way I showed it to you guys is how I pulled it out the box. Um, besides me just styling the front of it. I hadn't got any shedding from it. It's really soft. So, I would honestly give this wig a 10 out of 10, guys. Like, I would say if you're into short hair, go ahead and pick it up. Go ahead and check it out. I say she's a winner. Just my opinion. You know, that's all I can do is give you guys my opinion and honest feedback. But I say she's a winner. I say she's a bop. I say go ahead and get her. Because this wig is definitely... Like, let's go to a concert. Let's go to a Mary J. Blige concert. Like, I'm ready. Like, this is, this is the look. Rich auntie season loading, like I said. So if you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Comment down below something you enjoyed. Let me know how you feel about this wig. How do you feel about short hair in general? Are you a short hair girl or a long hair girl? Me, myself, I'm usually a long hair girl, but we getting out of our comfort zone. And we're going to wear some short hair. Hey, it's April. It's warming up. It's springtime. It's time to, you know, bring the looks. The, the bundles, the long hair ain't going to work for us right now because it's starting to warm up. So, I'm giving you guys some options to try. So, you know, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. You don't want to miss any videos. I post videos every Sunday and Thursday, and I promise you don't want to miss them. You especially don't want to miss this short wig series because I have about 10, 15 more wigs that I'm going to, re going to be reviewing for you guys. So, yeah, you want to stick around. You want to make sure you have that notification bell on so you don't miss anything. As always, thank you guys for the support. I really do appreciate it, and I will catch you in my next one. Peace.